Welcome back to DIY Willie and today, well, we're back in the Silverado and we have a request from a subscriber. Uh, the request is how to remove the lid to the center console. Uh, I did a video how to repair the latch and uh, now we're gonna do one on just how to take the, the lid off. Mine also needs to be replaced. It's cracked right where my big elbow sits there when I drive. I'll show you that right now. It's cracked right there where uh, my big elbow rests when I drive. So uh, we'll get at it and we'll take it apart. All right. So the inside, the inside, if you remember from my previous video on this, is a, a, a Torque 20. And it's got four screws. You take those four screws out. You take the, uh, the, the interior pry tool and you kind of loosen the, the panel all the way around and you take it off. So, uh, yeah, let's get on that right now. So you got the four torques. We'll just take them out like this. I should have found a nut driver, but the ratchet works. We'll just set the screws down in here somewhere. Now we just grab our trim removal tool, move it inside, and we just crack it loose. Just like that. There's a couple of them along the way, all the way down. Careful not to break it off. There, now we just take this bottom piece off, and you'll see the screws along the bottom. Now that you have that piece off, you'll see the four screws right here on the bottom. They're Phillips. I'll just set you up and we'll take those screws off. Okay, so after those four screws are removed, the top comes off quite easy. Now, there are new replacement covers. I've seen them on Amazon. Uh, of course, the coloring is gonna be a little bit different. The, uh, probably the, the quality, I'm not sure. I haven't ordered one yet. The quality might also be a little bit different. But yeah, you know, it's pretty easy to take off. It's just the four screws on the bottom and uh, to put it back on, just put the screws back in. Like I said, I don't have my cover yet. A uh, subscriber asked for this video, so I just showed him how to take it off. And I'll put it back on, and when my new cover comes, then I'll put the new one cover on. But to reinstall, just the reverse order. Okay, now it's back on, and we'll just reinstall this. Just snaps back into place. And you're done. There. And we're done. That's a really easy project. Uh, if you need to change out your cover. And uh, well, another successful DIY Willie project completed. Uh, like I said, when I get my new cover in, I'll do the process all over again to change it out because mine's cracked right here on the top. Uh, and I have a couple options. I thought about giving getting this one recovered maybe. Um, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what I do. So anyway, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Uh, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment. And uh, always come back to DIY Willie. All right. Thank you. Can't forget to put these screws back in. Look at that. I almost did it. Got a little excited. A little carried away. Butterfingers. There we go. We'll get these ran back in. Can't believe I almost forgot them. Don't forget them when you do it. Now we're done. 